Hey guys, it's Best from Pieces Tutorial here, and today I'm just going to be um, showing you, giving you some tips on how to beat the third um, gym leader on Pokemon Emerald. Okay? Um, so what the gym leader is is a uh, electric type sort of Pokemon. So I'd recommend having some water type and water and fire in your Pokemon team. Obviously, I've got my Mudkit, my Torchic, and my Pelipper. So that will be good. So I'm just going to put them. First, second, third, put it first. Okay, so go, go, go in. Now, it looks like there's gonna be a double match first. Or can I just go around? Yes. But now, okay. So I really don't know how to do this actually, to be honest. Yeah, I need to have a match now. Okay. Okay, I've got a match now. The um, Pokemon, the um, the gym leader will have electric Pokemon. I think he has a Voltorb, the little round electric Pokemon, a Magnite, Magnite, and the evolved the, the evolved version of Magnite, a Gold Pen. Do you know what a Water Gun would be like on a Gold Pen? Let's find out. Quite effective. But I have got a level 40 Pokemon, so. so every time I win a gym badge, um, I try to get my all my Pokemon up 10 ranks or 10 levels. So there's now, so now, now, I need to have a double battle, so I can get to up there where the gym leader is. Now there's going to be two of them here. So bear with me whilst I just do this. Yeah, some tips on um, how to beat the um, gym leader is, um, I see Voltorb, yeah, that's what the um, leader's got. I think he has both four Pokemon, actually, I'm not sure, I can't remember. Um, some tips, um, I'd recommend obviously using water type with water moves. I see on my mud kit now, I've got Whirlpool, which is a pretty decent move, which basically is like a water type move, which is traps it in a water. Forty-one yeah. in a vortex, and every round it's like a like when you get um, a poison, so you lose the point. That's basically that, but in like when you're stuck in a rope or shockwaves. Okay, and I think yeah, electric Pokemon are usually effective on um, water types. It's just I've got forty, like average level forty Pokemon, so obviously. That makes it a lot easier for me. It's hard work there. Yeah. Okay, so as you can see, I'm just trying to battle my way through this battle. Uh, okay, I took out both his Pokemon with one hit. Now I just got to take out their Pokemon. The last Pokemon this one is, which should be, which it was. And now I've done that, haven't I? Yep, okay, there's that battle done. Okay, and now the gym leader. Obviously, save it just in case you lose. Okay, and now it's good. Uh, just blabbering on about his gym and how I'm going to beat him so much. Okay, I think his name's yeah Watson. A Voltor level 20, so that's, ha that's 21 right levels be below my Pelipper. So we just use a water gun, see so yeah, how effective that is. Very effective, out of one here. Electrike, okay. Keep my Pelipper in. Try and keep, I'm going to try and keep this Pokemon in as far as long as I can. So then obviously I've still got my water, my, my water type mud kit, which could always do some more. He went out in one hit. Uh, what's oh god? Whoops. That. Who is next? Um. Oh, the evolved version. Water gun. I don't think this will take out in one hit. Level 24 that is. Quite close. Thunder wave. That makes me paralyzed. I've got a paralyzed heal in my um, bag. 
which I might use, but I'm not. Shockwave. Yeah. Ooh, that's very effective. See what I mean about a super potion? I might, I might use a potion in a minute. Depends. Well, I, I, I think, but if I got good quickness, I can take no. Okay, that's alright. Then there's two Pokemon left, I think. Two or one. And I've got another water type here. So now I'll go pull out my mud kit. Level 40, so that's only 16 right below my low, um, higher even water gun. Shockwave. Mm -hmm. There you go. It's quite effective. Water gun, see if that takes him out. Nope, not quite. You have like one XP left. Sorry, this video is going on for a lot longer than I thought it was, but hey. Let's see if there's no shockwave again. Let's see if. Three, got three left. It's never good. That Pokemon is quite strong. Is he out? Is he out? He's out. Either Watson is back to use Magaton. No. Magaton, the ass is ass Pokemon, so you know. This this leader's got quite a decent um shockwave thing I'm out. Okay, I still got my um fire type, my torchic. But Watson um is one of the harder ones out of all the eight to be honest. Mainly because of his type of Pokemon they're quite effective. I'm not sure how effective on a fire type they are though, but I'll just go find out what fire is like on metal. Very effective. Wow. I should have used the torture at the start. And there you go guys. Recommend using fire now. With the ember. I just took it out of the away. So yeah guys. Uh, as Watson was blabbering on about. Wow congratulations. Put a badge. Yeah. Um, can you leave a comment below. Um, whether if you're stuck on anything. On Pokemon Emerald. Sapphire Ruby. They're all really the same. Emerald has got a couple extra stuff I guess. Um, yeah. So if you're stuck on anything. Uh, just leave a comment below. Um, I'll do my best to um, make a tutorial out of it. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe for more Pokemon and tutorials. And yeah, goodbye.